during the week, news that former IMF chief Dominic Strauss Kahn is now a free man. The criminal case. Apparently, does not believe in equal justice under the law and has denied an innocent woman a day in court. Yet for Dominic Strauss Kahn's lawyers, this was a day they will not soon forget. Today is an extraordinary day, and it's an extraordinary event to have a district attorney stand up in a public courtroom and dismiss an indictment concluding that the complaining witness is not worthy of belief. As for the man who has been the center of international news stories since May 14th, when the incident was said to have occurred, it was all smiles. He thanked his family for standing by him through it all. The appeal for a special prosecutor now rejected it by the highest state court. Dominic Strauss-Kahn is free to leave the country. All that is left against him is the civil case, which too could collapse. Natalie Carney reporting for Channel News Asia in New York. And still on the political front, freshly elected Thai Prime Minister Yin Lok Shinawat unveiled her new government's policies in Parliament. Observers are concerned that her ambitious plans could place her in the op. witness is not worthy of belief. As for the man who has been the center of international news stories since May 14th, when the incident was said to have occurred, it was all smiles. He thanked his family for standing by him through it all. <laughs> attack point for the opposition. 